New details this afternoon about the radiation leak at the WIP site and just how much radiation was released. The leak happened February 14th in an area underground that has remained off limits since. Today, the company that has been testing the air and filters released their findings. They say at the height of the leak, one air filter measured at more than 1,300 BQs of America. That's nearly and nearly 700 BQs of plutonium. That level deemed safe by the EPA is 37 BQs, but they say this is not the radioactive material that was released into the environment. There's a second filter which leads to the outside. Testing shows levels of 1.81 and 0.22 well below the EPA standards. The company who tested the sample says that is evidence the filters worked. They continue to take samples on a daily basis and say they continue to show reduced levels of radiation. They also say samples will be taken of soil and groundwater in the area. The DOE is holding a town hall tomorrow night to update the public on the situation. It is at 530 at the Walter Gerald's Performing Arts Center.